the Red Flag CA770TJ microphone car coming up next on Monster Hobbies What's in the Box? Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Slescu and welcome back to another episode of Monster Hobbies What's in the Box where we're going to look at the Red Flag CA770TJ microphone car and now like last week another great limousine from the chinese republic now let's go down and open up the lid on this great model and welcome back again down to our bench to view the red flag ca770 tj car of china now what makes this different from the limo that we've seen previously is that this has the open roof and the microphones for the government official to make the speech in his car. So we will just open up the box now. Now this was one that I started to work on, but that's okay because I didn't do too much to her. When you buy one of these, it will not be half work done, so don't worry. <laughs> I bought this at the IPMS, which is a model show, for $15 on October 7, 2000. So over 18 years ago. It's got Chinese writing in there because Trumpeter is a Chinese company. And then underneath we have English. And these are very similar to the other Car China limousine. Same engine, same body, except with the roof, hole in the roof. So if you want more in depth on the instructions, you can look at it on my other video. And of course it shows the car going together. Easy to follow instructions and quite a nice display model. Now this one, unlike the limo from last week, has the parts out of the bag and as you can see these are your pre-cut. These go onto your floor pans and seats. They are the red carpet of course. And now here in better detail are the seats and you can notice the nice interior upholstery pattern in there and here are the other seats and the front separation partition wall which are painted in this kind of color that's supposed to represent wood grain although it is quite a strange color you may want to try to repaint this with your own color so you can get a good color match because as soon as you cut this off the tree, of course, you're going to have a different color plastic there. That fell on the floor. Okay, so there's our tires again, which are the identical tires to the limousine kit. And here are the black components. You know, it's a nice detail on the dashboard and in the spring leaves, the top of the front suspension has the little rivets right in there. And you get a separate fuel tank. And there's the, the sway arm for your posable steering. It also has a little gear there. So this has rack and pinion type of steering on it. Then, of course, getting back to our glass again. Going to keep this in the bag just to keep them from scratching, but you do get red taillights, a red hood emblem, and amber turn signals, as well as the clear windows. Now here, I have the body and the frame. And as you can see, the fit is very nice between the three components. There are a couple little mounting location pins here and holes underneath the frame. So of course this will go together nice. This is the part that I was working on. Got to sand it down nice and smooth. The red and then of course your upholster patterns are going to go and stick on these floorboards here. And the body, I have cleaned up the seam lines on it, basically. But you'll notice the hole in the roof and the three little holes for the microphones. They actually give you the emblem pre-printed on there, which is quite nice. But 
I'm going to spray this with gloss black so I'm going to end up losing those. These are holes for your screws to go into under the frame. And the, here's another part of this. There's the hood and you can notice that the gaps between the hood and the fender are pretty much non-existent. So it is a nice hood to fit together on your model car. Same with the trunk lid here. Nice good fit with no gaps really, just panel lines, which is quite uh, a nice thing. Something that Ravel and Monogram and those AMT and the other guys could or try to duplicate. Duplicate. It's a nice finish on there. And finally, or not so finally, we have our chrome parts tree with many, many parts, including the engine and a nice grill with uh, separate teeth that you can see through for that added bit of realism. And then, of course, our axle springs and screws that we need for the kit. And that will conclude our examination of the Red Flag CA770 TJ Car of China. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Monster Hobbies What's in the Box, where we got to look at the Red Flag CA770 TJ Microphone Car by Trumpeter. And if you would like to make a small donation to our web channel so that we can continue to make these great videos, please check out our YouTube homepage and look in the banner for the little PayPal icon. And if you would like to visit our hobby shop online and maybe buy some stuff, <laughs> check it out at www.monster-hobbies.ca. And if you want to see some of our videos from the last few times, check them out here, here, and here and don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel right here and click the notification bell so that you will always be notified when a new video comes up and until next time happy model building